Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> it's like 10:30. Yep. Um, we had. We've already had an adventure this morning. Yes, we have. <laughs> Found out that there's a Walmart pretty close to the value resorts. Like really close. Like yeah. it took maybe like eight minutes to get there. Yeah, it was not far. And it was a really cheap lift ride too. Mm-hmm. Like four bucks. Yeah. Um, Grant's still not feeling well. It made even worse this morning, huh? Yeah. So we had to run, do a do a medicine run. They just don't have the medicine that we needed um, at the park. Yeah, and especially I don't want to keep going back there every morning just to get two doses for the day. And yeah, they just didn't have what we needed. But it was really great if you're just like feeling a little congested, but I think that you're kind of past that. Yeah, I think so too. It's so, kind of settled in. Yeah, we went to Walmart to get some Mucinex. Highly recommend doing it that way if you need anything more than what you can get at the park. Yeah, because that was really, great. It was cheap. It was, it was like five bucks. There. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, it was... It was good. I guess, okay, it was five bucks. I had a half off though. Oh, that's so true. So it'd like probably be under $10. Yeah, like like $9.50, Yeah. Um, Because I had like a half up, up to $3, I think. Something gotcha. like that. Um, so yeah, it'd probably be like 8 or $9 to get there. It was really quick. Um, they had the pharmacy right at the front, did, which was and nice. They all the cold stuff out. Mm-hmm. I knew and we then were gonna, like, saw us coming a mile away. Yeah, and then another lift came and picked us up. Um, to, and took us right to Hollywood Studios. So took, yeah, less than ten <laughs> minutes to get here too. So yep. So starting a little late, but hopefully it'll make you feel better. Yeah, and hopefully the meds kick in. And, uh, yeah. And now we're gonna go to Toy Story Land. Yeah, I'll ride Slinky Coaster again. Mm hmm. Which is so fun. Mm hmm. We go ride it once at night. Now we'll ride it during the day. I couldn't believe that I got a fast pass for this twice this early too. Oh yeah. Good job. You can look fast passes. <laughs> well, the oh. trick with that is that you have to get them. You have to get the fast passes like at toward the end of your trip first, because <laughs> you can get them for your whole trip on the day that um, they open up for you. Like, so the 60 days before. Mm, so that's when it's like 64, 65 days before the last days. So not yeah. a lot of people have those available yet. Well, I knew I wanted us to go to Hollywood Studios this morning, so I went, that is like what I did first. There she is in the daytime. Ready? I might be a but I still got a spring in my step. I love this ride. Me too. Yeah. Because like on Disney Channel or something, they had like a whole thing about how fast it starts. Oh yeah, I remember that.
in the boiler room, maybe? Oh, probably. Quinn's not feeling very well. Not well at all. Mm -hmm. Might head back to the hotel for a bit, take a nap. Well, that'll be the rest of my little weary eyes. Sometimes this happens, you just gotta take it easy. Better to no, it's better to rest up than to not enjoy your vacation. True. We'll get you a nap. Both arms up, please, arms up for just a moment. I do hope you enjoy your stay. Please, the laws are getting over. Come on. It's just me. Um, Grant is really not feeling very well, which is such a bummer. For his birthday trip, his sinuses are just all clogged up and he just needs some rest. Um, but he, we, we kind of just hung out all afternoon for a few hours in the room and he's still just not feeling better, but he really wanted me to go do something. Um, so I'm gonna go to Epcot and hang out at Festival of Arts for a bit and just enjoy it. I feel bad leaving Grant, but I honestly think he needs some sleep and he wasn't able to really fall asleep with me there because um, he's worried about snoring and everything. He's just so stuffed up. Um, so he's self-conscious and wasn't able to fall asleep super well. So I'll probably sleep better if I'm not there. Um, but I feel bad leaving him. But we're going to make the most of it and I'm going to go enjoy some Festival of the Arts. And some kind of party sounds like it's happening over there. <laughs> oh, pool party. Really? It feels like it's late for a pool party. It's seven, but... And there's Isabella Fountain behind me. Look at her. Oh, she's never not beautiful. Found it. Everybody's leaving. Which is weird because it's over an hour till the park closes, but sorry, so many people are leaving. But I guess they don't want to watch illuminations. <laughs> Which I'll probably watch just the fireworks. Look at these straight out of Mary Poppins. Oh wow, these are so cool. I just walked over here to get away from the crowds, but man. These are really cool. Lots of Treasure Planet ones. Oh my goodness. You know what? You weren't on the other boat. Finger paint cake. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
going to loop around the showcase, enjoying how pretty it is at night, and seeing if there's any more art that we didn't see last time. Because we did kind of just skim through too quick last time, I think, so I'm going to look around at everything. So pretty at night. Crystal moon cake. Ooh, yum. I've never watched Reflections of China because every time that I've gone in to watch it, something's happened. <laughs> like, I don't know, once it got canceled, and another time somebody like had a medical issue. So I've just never had the opportunity. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I love they have these um, character drawings or paintings. They have these character paintings by each of the character meet spots. I also never noticed that Snow White has this little fountain. But these are so cool. Donald has one too. I'll have to look for Alice's and Belle's and Mary Poppins. Oh, I can see some fireworks happening over there. Must be Hollywood Studios. Also, I was gonna get a frosé, but I forgot my ID. <laughs> but I'll get some kind of frozen drink, I think. I've seen the Star Wars fireworks so many times just from far away. <laughs> Actually, that might be Magic Kingdom. Because those are the smiley faces. Oh yeah, that has to be if it's over there. Oh, okay, that's Happily Ever After. Huh. Can't believe you can see it so well from all the way over here. I love this little village, but they light up the train at night. Too cute. Oh, there's another one. I love this song. I love this song so much. It's from Lion King too. Slash the musical, but oh my gosh. Oh, we're here just for the good part, you guys. Good. Who is this? Let's find this out. Thank you. 
Alton Fitzgerald, longest running Mufasa on Broadway. Wow. Cool. He's good. I'm glad I got to hear that. I love that song. I love these pictures that you can take a photo op in, but oh my gosh, this one's so funny. <laughs> Here comes the general. It is such a comfortable temperature out right now, you guys. I am loving it. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Let's see if I can make my way over there. This is cool. Let's see, the light makes it a little hard to see. Look at that. That's too cool. These are all like artistic frames. Oh, he's working on that one right now. Wow, he's making these here. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. Oh wow. All the Winnie the Pooh ones. Ah, oh, rescuers! Dang, they are really good. like these Broadway concerts. I think those are really cool. Um, usually they just have like, they have different things. Like they had a Guardians of the Galaxy concert for a while, or they have like the beat, each of the beats, where they have like band, different bands come, and those are really cool too, but I'm a theater nerd, so I like the Broadway ones. The songs I recognize, sung by really awesome people who have been on Broadway, so that's, Really cool. Oh, I'm gonna go in here. So this is the mural that everybody can paint on. It's coming along. So they give you a paintbrush, you buy a paintbrush with a certain color on it and tell you the number. Ooh, this would focus. And you can paint on any of those numbers. It's pretty cool. I went to Electric Umbrella. We got a pineapple coconut slushy, and it is so good. I just was craving something cold. And it's delicious, guys. Hmm. How many of you 
Miss Grant, but hey, I've had a nice evening here. It's lovely. Enjoying my slushy. It's so good. And probably gonna just find a spot close to the exit and watch the fireworks. Um, and then kind of try to hop out before it's too late. <laughs> before there's a long, long line. I found a nice little bench and a little pocket where I can see the fireworks. It was kind of nice. not the perfect view but I'm very comfortable and they're playing they're not playing the illuminations music back here they're playing just the future world music which I really like so it's just lovely this will probably be the last time I think it will be the last time I ever see illumination Not my favorite show, but I love the fireworks. Ooh. I think that up there is part of the Guardians of the Galaxy construction. That building wasn't even there last time we were here. Okay, so this is all Guardians of the Galaxy over here. And then, oh, let's see, over here too. It's gonna be a huge ride. It must be. Didn't they say, I think they just read a fact where it was the biggest concrete pour in Disney history? But anyway. It's starting to rain, so I gotta put the camera away, but bye Spaceship Earth, I'll miss you. I don't know when I'm gonna see you again, but keep being beautiful. I love you. Bye. Coming together. Where's the other thing? So cool.